Yes, lads, and welcome back to the Jebo37 YouTube channel, where today, guys, we are bringing something brand new to the channel, which is Everton women against Redden women at Walton Hall Park. So, the home of Everton women, what do we know about them? Redden women are 6th, Everton women are 10th in a 12-team league. I don't really know anything about the two teams going into this competition, apart from where they are in the league and the points, really. It's just something like that. Um, there's one player that I do know of, and that's Tony Duggan, who does play for Everton Women. Um, she was at Man City. She had a very great season at Man City or something, and got a move to Atletico Madrid and Barcelona in Spain. So that's how I only know of her, to be honest. Um, so apart from that, I don't really know anything about it. But today, guys, I'm going to be predicting a 1-0 win to the Everton Women, especially after the Brentford game. I feel like it's something that I want to take into more of a positive note going forward, especially into the weekend, you know, obviously the game being Sunday and all that good stuff. So make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, tap the bell for more notifications, and let me know what other content you want me to do regarding Everton. And just, yeah, anything that I can do to bring out the Everton content for you guys will be, yeah, great enough, I suppose. And... If you want to see me go to more Everton women's games and have double the content most weeks, then please let me know down in the comments down below. And make sure you smash a thumbs up on the video as well. So for now, guys, I shall see you at Walton Hall Park. Up the toffees!
The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of one minute additional time.
station for Everton. Number five, coming off at Natalie Bjorn, her replacement is number 20, Megan Finnegan. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's a goal to Redden. It is 2 1 late on in the game. Goal scorer to your Primer. There was a bit of a scramble in the box, which just led to the ball being slotted in the back of the net, really. So, and I'm a bit disappointed, really, about the Everton winning because, to be fair, they had the chance to kill the game. You know, they had the penalty, they got missed and whatnot. So, it, it, it don't really know what to say, really. It was absolutely freezing here. That's why I look like I'm absolutely wrapped but warm and stuff like that. So, you know, hopefully, we can see a late equaliser. Come on, Everton. support here today at Walton Hall Park. We'd like to wish you all a safe journey home and we hope to see you here again at our next home game again. So full time here at Walton Hall Park. I am walking towards the bus stop now like but we finished Everton 1, Redden 2. Um, so I'll explain more about it to be honest when I'm home and just explain about the game, my thoughts and all that stuff. So yeah I'll see you when I'm home. So guys we are back from Walton Hall Park. I've had some time to reflect, some time to think and 2-1 to the Redden women and you know what it was a decent decent game you know and I don't normally take things lightly like that and you know I'm quite critiqued on a football match if I don't enjoy it I'll put it out there I don't enjoy it but today guys it, you know it was a good game um goal coming from Anna Anvergaard I think her name is for for uh, um, Everton women I do think they give it to Claire Emsley as well the goal but obviously doing me very research it, it got changed so and obviously the penalty miss off Isabel Christensen as well. Obviously, I do have the names in front of me because obviously I don't know much about the women's team or anything like that. So hopefully it's something new for me to learn, you know, the players' names and all the stuff like that. And obviously the goals for Natasha Dowie and Tia Prim, I think her name was for Redden. Obviously sealed the game for them. 2-1, you know, Everton were unfortunate. You know, they had the penalty to, to possibly make it 2-0. It was a great save from the keeper as well. You know, the Everton women's keeper making some great saves and some decent sets of play as well within the game. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe and hopefully, guys, you enjoyed the vlog. And let me know what other vlogs you want to see me do regarding Everton, whether it's the under-23s, um, obviously the women, whether it's more away matches or if there's a different team, say if Everton are on, on that you want, to go, want me to go and see to vlog. I'll do that as well guys but yeah make sure you like make sure you subscribe smash the bell for more notifications thank you so much for the support 
and I shall see you guys on another video.